Hello everyone, welcome to Pan Reading Freya. My name is Lorena Johnson. I'm going to be reading for you for the month of April. This reading is for everyone under the zodiac sign of Cancer. Let's begin. Cancer, what is important to know for Cancer for the month of April? I'm open, open to receive for Cancer. Okay, there's some tightness, okay? There's some tightness that I feel with you Cancers. Uh, this can indicate, okay, maybe you are trying to do too much, um, uh, things are stressing you out. I also feel for some of you pain in the, on the back, okay? This is uh, barely below the shoulder blades. Um, it is uh, maybe because you are trying to do too much or there is something that you would like to express or communicate. But for one reason or another, you might not feel it like it's easy or it's possible. Let's see. Um, cancer, what is important to know for cancer? Month of April. Month of April for cancer. Cancer. Can you take? Pull out, pull out your cards. So try to relax. Try to do things that you enjoy, especially if you are dealing with too much. In the month of April, my advice will be to... Um, go swimming okay and if there are um, situations and people around you that are are making it hard for you okay it's like um, you can't talk <laughs> it's like you can't talk to someone you can't get through someone you cannot communicate with someone okay let's see Mm. Cancer. Oh my gosh, I just felt something. Okay, you might receive a message um, that it can be annoying or it can be something very unexpected. When it comes to love, what is important to know for cancer? Love, love. What is happening with cancer in the month of April? Okay, children are being an issue in your life. Maybe this is because you and your partner cannot uh, come on the same page when it comes to how to educate the children, what is best for you and him, for both to do, and etc. things like that. Uh, cancer guidance. Guidance. I do feel that for some of you, if you've been having a lot of complications or a lot of problems within your home, this is uh, if uh, uh, you had you had gone already or you go through a breakup in the month of April, it will be highly advisable for you to think about getting a pet, especially if you have children. I think this will alleviate the pain and the tears or the, you know, the, I don't know, I just feel this um Tie nets, okay? As soon as I began doing your reading, I felt like, okay, something is tight, something is closing up, something is very hard. Either these are words that you cannot express or the situations that are happening in your life are a little bit difficult for you, okay? So I pulled the Damara, guiding children. You are good at helping, counseling, and healing children. Is use your skills to help children now. Okay, so your children, you need to focus on your children. What is the problem? Because uh, maybe one of your children is feeling depressed, sad, or because of things that have happened, okay? Or maybe um, this uh, child is feeling like uh, insecure, okay? It might be a lot of things going on. Uh, in his or her head about are we going to be okay or does my mother loves me or not uh, does my father love me uh, etc things like that is important for you cancer to pay attention okay so in the past I see arguments misunderstandings fights within the home because some money is not there or some money has been lost and there is um, arguments and miscommunication within the family about the finances. This can be also about responsibilities. You can be the man in this reading, uh, or you can be dealing with a man, if you are a woman listening to this reading, with a man with this energy. This man is very um, strong, okay? I will say strong because um, he's mentally strong. He is responsible. He knows what he wants. When... Um, 
when he knows he's in love with someone, he will not be hot and cold. He is there for the long run. The men that I'm seeing can be under the zodiac sign of Earth, which is uh, Taurus, Virgo, and I think Capricorn. Look it up to make sure. Um, this man is bringing security, but for one reason or another, you and this man are not meeting eye to eye, or maybe he is progressing or moving toward you very slowly, and there has been the relationship or the situation stuck. It's like nothing is happening, there's no communication, he is not moving toward you, you're not moving toward him, it's a uh, standstill, okay, like nothing is happening. The reason why highly possible you and him are having arguments once and again, this is either because of the children, how to educate them, the, he says it's time for the children to go to sleep, they don't listen, you don't support his uh, plans and ideas, or he doesn't support you either. It is going to be important to have communication and to come, okay, into an agreement. Okay, how are we going to do this? For some of you, I see positive changes. Either you are moving to a new home or moving to a new home or place is highly advisable for you because I can already see that those changes are in your favor. That are the best thing that you can do at this moment, get on board with the changes, resolve anything um, as fast as you can, and don't be your own obstacle. Move things around, okay? Move things around and know that uh, the change is for the better, that you are on the right track. I also see someone entering your life or you will have communication with someone, okay? This is an offer, but this is like, no, you're gonna be like, no, no thank you because this is not what I want at this moment. That doesn't satisfy me. That doesn't make me happy. It's not what I'm looking for right now. I also see there is going to be a lot of things, okay? A lot of explanations, a lot of communication. This can be either with family, friends, and etc. things like that. For the most part, I feel that most of you are going to be like, you know what? No, 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 don't come over right now. Or don't be texting me. Don't be messaging me because I don't want to be explaining everyone what is happening why is happening i don't want people to be reaching out to me um, thinking that they can help or wanting an explanation okay uh, for this i also see that some of you are gonna decide okay um, for now i'm going to do nothing i'm just going to wait just to see if things can resolve by themselves this is also because you don't want to hurt anyone. You don't want to hurt yourself. You don't want to hurt the other person. You don't want to hurt yourself. You don't want to hold your children. But in the inaction, this is telling me you are not seeing things clearly or you are not accepting the reality. You trying to cover it up or thinking that if you don't see it, it's not going to be there. That is not going to be the case. But I do feel that you are doing this, okay, either to protect yourself or because you are not ready, okay, to take uh, the next step in what is best or necessary for you to do. I also see uh, sadness, depression, once again, fights, misunderstandings, but this is more in a, uh, maybe in a, in a, in closed doors, okay, closed doors, you're not letting anybody else know that you are sad and depressed about misunderstandings that you had had with your partner or that you will have in the month of April and you are crying in silence, okay? It's like crying in silence, not being able to resolve the issue, not being able to not think about what happened or how it happened and etc. things like that. Please, if you need to wait, I will advise you, please just wait. If you're going to talk, okay, or you, if you are going to communicate with someone, it's highly important, okay, that you make sure that you are really communicating and not turning an opportunity to communicate or resolve into an argument because that is going to be a tendency for many of you uh, cancers in the month of um, April. Uh, not having the ability, okay, to communicate effectively, and every time you try, um, it doesn't work. Now, if you are looking for a new job, okay, a career, or a new opportunity in life, 
don't be with their mind okay i want it to be like this and like this and like this because if they don't pay me this much then i don't want it i deserve more i need more okay it is better to to create movement with anything to begin with this is just to create the momentum you accept any job once you have that job and you like okay i'm still applying for the job of my dreams uh, while you are already working um, it is fine okay you can you can have the job that you want but you cannot remain in the waiting okay now no waiting not doing nothing is it's not advisable you get on board with the changes you do those changes you accept any job any job while you already in a job looking for the ideal job okay waiting for that special call waiting for that uh, uh, company or uh, wherever you had ambition in the past that you want or deserve uh, while you are waiting but you are not waiting at home you are waiting already with whatever is available okay uh, any job that is available this is just to create the movement and this is just to start spinning the wheel okay in the right direction once you start spinning that wheel and you're like okay i'm gonna jump off this wheel and get on board this other wheel that gives me more that brings me more stability more success then you can do that but please do not remain at a standstill move it okay it's time to move it uh, talk to your children get a pet if that is um if that is something that um that you could do thank you um very much for allowing me to read for you as always please don't forget to like share and subscribe thank you for allowing me i wish you a wonderful day bye